So it is Monday, September 25th. As you can see, I'm still laying in the bed. I have been up today. I woke up a little before 10. I already had my coffee. I had bagel. I, I actually already had lunch. It's like almost 3 o'clock, if not after 3. I'm so happy today. But anyway, let's start off with I did not close the vlog last night because I was tired. We were at the fair until it closed at 10 o'clock. It was not our intentions to stay that late, but... It is what it is. Tempe was out of school. She's out of school all this week. Jamie did have to work today. But we got home maybe around like 10, 20. I took a shower, gave Tempe a bath. We were in the bed. Um, we had a lot of fun. We only got on one ride because Tempe did not want to ride anything until she had ice cream. Got on the one ride. She wanted to ride it again. By the time we got in line, it was closed. So... Um, today I have been just trying to get through some emails and I need to do a few things around the house, but I've also been just looking at some things for Timby's bathroom. Well, I've been looking at some things for her bathroom for a while in my downtime. I've pretty much redesigned our whole house. So I have created Pinterest boards for every room. So all the new bedding that I want to get for each bedroom, redoing Timby's bathroom, um, I want to get a sectional in the great room. I want to change out pretty much every light in this house. I want to change out the two fans that we have. I want to get two more fans in the other bedroom and probably one downstairs in Jamie's man cave. What else do we plan on doing? Um, want to get new bedroom furniture. So, of course, we have our new bed, which I absolutely love. And I want to get two new dressers in here. I haven't narrowed down the ones I want. But anyway, I'll go over all of that um, as we go through that process. Because we are going to do things room by room. But we have decided that certain pieces that we want to get that maybe go on sale or clearance. Or that we feel like might be discontinued. We want to go ahead and get those when we have the money to do it. But... Um, we're we're going to do everything room by room. I'm not sure what room we're going to start with yet. And then um, I'm happy because, for one, I'm getting this wig done today. Well, the start of getting this wig done today. So I made an appointment to go get my hair washed and get a hydration treatment. And then I'm going to get it blow dried. And then tomorrow morning, I'm going to get my hair braided because I'm over it. Like, I hate doing my hair. It is still very dry, so I'm overdue for steam treatment. And then, um, because we're going to North Carolina on Wednesday, we're leaving super early in the morning. We will not be back until Sunday. And then next week, I will be attending Danae and Blanc. So next Saturday, October 7th, it is an all-white party that takes place every year. It started in France. And I think at this point, pretty much every state has their own Danae and Blanc. And this will be my second year attending. I've been a member for three years now. Um, what else is going on? I think that's it. And then I'm also assisting with a wedding in Alabama the day before, so October 6th. So, yeah, I just really don't want to have to deal with my hair. So, I really lucked up by getting this last-minute appointment to get my hair washed, straightened, steamed, and braided. Um, so, not only that, like, I, I just... I don't know what else to do with this. Like, this is the season to get my hair straightened. But because of how bad I sweat, it just will not last very long. Like, I love how my hair looks when it gets straightened. It's literally, like, on my shoulders. But, no, I just, I can't deal. When I get in the shower, I start sweating. The roots start drawing up. So, that's usually something that I only try to do when... And it's a very special occasion, and I feel like I want to get my hair straightened for the occasion or whatever outfit I'm wearing, that it goes with that look. And I know I only need it to last a day or two, but uh, we're going to get some braids for the next maybe month or two, and then that'll give me some time to figure out what I'm going to do next. But I will check back in a little bit later. It is Tuesday, September 26th. As you can see, I'm in the car again. Uh, I am on my way to get my hair braided. So excited about that so I don't have to deal with my hair for the next couple weeks or month or two or whatever. After 
after that, um, coming back to the house because there's really nothing else I need to do outside of the house. I need to be washing clothes because I think we're leaving at like four o'clock in the morning to go to North Carolina. I want to straighten up the house a little bit and I'm trying to decide if I'm going to do like a little um, short video about some of the things that I've purchased for fall. I think I actually do want to do that if I have time. It's a little after 1030. My appointment is at 11 and the, it's supposed to take like three hours. She never takes that long. It usually takes like an hour and a half and I'm getting large braids um, I don't really want to deal with the small ones because it just makes things easier when I'm trying to take them out so I'm hoping that I'll be done by like one so that I can get back home and do whatever I need to do around the house and then try to do this fall clothes haul so I will check back in maybe once I get to the salon maybe when I get back home Okay, it is Thursday, September 28th. It's my mommy's birthday. Me and Timby are on our way to Winston so we can spend some time with my mommy. I'm not really sure what we're gonna do. It is like 1.30. Have like less than an hour and a half until we get to Winston. So past lunchtime, and I really wanted to try to give back before dinner time, before it got too late. So... Yeah, so we can take a bath uh, and, and play with all the bubbles. Okay. So not sure what we're gonna do when we get here. Uh, my mom is actually on her way to uh, my doctor's appointment, so we'll be getting there right around the time that hopefully she should be wrapping things up. So. Maybe we'll take her to lunch. I'm not really hungry. I had Waffle House this morning. Um, so I'm still pretty full. I may get a snack. Don't know. So I'm gonna be trying to figure out what we're gonna do when we get here. She didn't really mention anything that she wanted to do. So maybe we'll just hang out with her at her house. I actually need to stop and get her a birthday card anyway. I meant to do it yesterday. I'll check back in once we get to Winston. You can play outside when we get to Grandma. Okay. Yes. Happy birthday. <laughs> Look at you. It's your birthday with And her is cuteable. wake up about 6 in the morning. I told Grandma, my back hurt. I'm thinking the pain come up with the stomach. She said, honey, that's labor pain. Contraction. I said, I'll be back. I'm like, I don't know what they talking about. <laughs> so I caught the bus and went on the school. So the teacher was a nurse. She had everybody tied in my contraction. I rode the bus home. Got on in the bed. But by the damn clock, I couldn't take the pain. I had to call your daddy. He cut, he would cut through the streets up by grandma's house from the gulf from uh, He's running down there. He rode in the car with me uh, in front of uh, that face. I don't think grandma knew parent mama. So he was there. He was there when he was born. He was done. We can have an Easter. I came home on Easter. I seen you put that on something. I came home on Easter. 
on one of my vlogs. My mama said I'm an Easter baby. <laughs> <laughs> you were. Everybody was coming by at the church. To see you. I think I'm going to vegetables. Even though the sausage patties I had today were They were pretty good. So we're at my in-law's house and my mother-in-law pointed out yesterday that Timby's graduation picture looks just like her dad. We've had these pictures since May and we keep forgetting to send Timby. Give me the picture. I just, Timby, four, three, no. Hand it to me gently. Try again. Hand it to me gently. Thank you. Okay, so I just have to show you how much they look alike. I thought she looked like me, but hey. Tempe. Are they not twins? The same face, the same smile, the same teeth. <laughs> really, <laughs> Tempe. Okay, so it is. What day is this? Friday. It's Friday, September 29th. We're finally on our way to the beach. As I was packing up all of our stuff, I realized that I forgot so much. I didn't bring any beach towels. We didn't bring chairs. Uh, what else did we forget? I mean, I did at least remember swimsuits, but I'm a, we can just get towels from the hotel. We booked our room. We literally just did that today. Stopped at Walmart to get a few things. Like almost 2 30 and we just got on the road but anyhow we prayed before we started and I think that's it so I will check back in when we get to the hotel Turn right. You've entered the parking lot for your destination.
Okay, everybody is finally showered. We had a lot of fun at the beach. It's 9 p.m. We're about to go down to the boardwalk and get some food and drinks. I just have on these shorts from Express and tank top from American Eagle. And then I just have on my Birkenstocks. And gold hoops are from J. Crew Factory, I think. And then I have my hair up in a bun. Uh, and I think I'm gonna keep it this way. I just put it up while I was in the shower so I could wash my face. Um, but I think I'm gonna keep this. Keep it up in this style. So I will pick back up once we get downstairs to the boardwalk. to go to Wahlburger, Sunny. 
we were gonna try to go to Wahlburgers for dinner, but I kind of wanted to try something different because we actually have a Wahlburgers in Atlanta. So we went to one of the local spots called The Hangout. It's actually where we were when they had the live music. Um, I got the shrimp dinner, Jamie got chicken dinner, Cindy got popcorn shrimp. It was okay. Like it's a cool place to go. They have a lot of like slushy drinks that you can order. Apparently they have performances inside the restaurant where people dance on the tables. We didn't get to experience that last night. Um, but yeah, Tempe got popcorn shrimp and it was actually in like a bag that you would put popcorn in. So it had actual popcorn and popcorn shrimp in there. She loved it. But yeah, the, the shrimp were nothing amazing. They were hot. The fries were good. But it just tastes like they just seasoned it with Old Bay and that was it. So a little bit underwhelming. To me, the chicken tenders were actually good. Jamie thought they were all right. What did you think about the chicken tenders? He thought they were all right, but we tried something that was local. Um, definitely, you okay? Okay. Okay. When we come back, want to try something else that's local, a different restaurant here, especially because we're by the beach, so want to try the seafood. Jamie wanted to get the fish, but he said that he didn't like the way it smelled, so <laughs> he didn't order that. He just kept it safe but pick back up when we get to the outlet. <laughs> Splash pad. You want to go over there? It is Sunday, September, okay, no, I keep doing that. It is Sunday, October 1st. We're finally home, thank God we made it home safely. I have a few packages at the door that I wanna open and then once I get done with that, I'll probably close out the vlog because I am starving and exhausted. So let me get these packages from the door, show you what. Timby, you okay? Timby, you okay? Yes. I don't have a charger. Let me get the Tempe. They don't want to see that you don't have a charger. Look, Let me get this. Twenty-one. I mean, it's October the one, and it's ready. And and our fall break is over. Yes, your fall break is out. Let me get these packages from the door. I'll be right back. Here it is, Fox. Anything else, Your Majesty? Um, that's it, Mom. That's it, Majesty. When? Why can't you carry this one? I don't know. You don't know? Stop throwing shoes down the stairs. I can. No, come here so we can open up the packages. Come on. I think, let's see where this is from. I think these are Tempe's um, the bath mats, the new bath mats for the bathroom. And this is our waffle maker. Waffle maker, I wanna open it. And I got some really cute knee high socks for Tempe for school and some tights. Okay, let me cut it open, Tempe.
for Halloween. You like it, Tony? Yes. So I just have two pair, well four pair, and you get two pair in each pack, and then some um, tights to wear to school. That one I think I'm going to have to cut open, honey. No, I So this is Tempe's new bathroom mat. I actually ordered two of them. I put this on her Pinterest board for her bathroom when I decided that I wanted to redo her bathroom and her bedroom. It sold out online before I could purchase it. I decided to contact customer service to see if they had any available in stores. I found a store that had three. I ordered two. So this is from Pottery Barn Kids. And the original price was $40. I actually got it for $28 because I do get a 20% discount from all of the Williams Sonoma brands by being a part of the trade program because I am a small business owner and you fill out the application and provide your business tax ID. I'm not 100% sure what direction I want to go in with her bathroom yet. I thought about um, kind of coordinating it with the bedding that we bought her, the rainbow bedding from Pottery Barn Kids, because they do have a really cute rainbow bath mat that I wanted to get to put in front of her bathtub. This one is going to go in front of her sink, but I'm not sure if I want to do that, if I want to keep it more neutral. Um, I definitely will be recording whatever I decide to do. With that being said, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here because I'm starving and exhausted. Thank you for watching and check back in next week. Subscribe and like bell to click on Mommy's videos.